Okay, so this is, or these are the swatches. Ooh, what did I do down there? Anyway, these are double swatches because I filmed uh, this video more than once. Um, I'm kind of, like I said, doing a first impression on this because I wasn't sure where to go ahead and start. Um, for me, this is very intimidating. So this is going to be a very wearable palette for a lot of people. And for me, this includes me. Um, the Off Melrose palette doesn't include me, and that's fine. I don't expect to be included in everything, but that palette is for a different group of people. Uh, this palette does include me, and I really wasn't expecting it. So, um, again, I would really suggest that you go and pick it up. I think the ColourPop took a real chance, and it's paying off, and that's... I mean, with the whole theme going on here. And um, let's see, the only thing about this look that's really pissing me off right now is that this lip color is making, is washing me out. So this is the Maybelline uh, number 130, and we're going to go ahead and add it in because this just is right. So, let me add an orangey, an orangey orange in there. See, now this part of my face, when I, is, you see this part of my face now. When I had on that neutral, you can see this part of my face, and it looked a little bit weird, because where are her lips? You know, kind of thing. So, um, I do have on, let's see. Um, a lip liner, which is this one, and let's see, it's a BH Cosmetics Waterproof Sorbet. So that's what I have on there, and um, with the orange on top of it now. And I'm liking it a lot better. So, yeah. And, uh, yeah. Um, again, as far as this palette goes, I would go ahead and suggest mixing it with pretty please again pretty please is going to be again neutrals but it's leaning much more in the gray the mauve the rosy and the gold area but putting these two together i think um first of all the formulas match and that isn't just because they're in the same kind of pans but um, you can get a brush into these pants. It's so nice to have a big pan size for some of us. But um, it's not the end of the world. If a palette doesn't, I can work around it. But uh, these two together are just amazing. And um, Natasha Denona, you came up with another amazing color story that just leaves me kind of going. And then ColourPop. Yeah. Uh, thank you. We need both price points, and uh, when they unwittingly collab with each other, sometimes they come up with amazing things, is what I'm trying to say, which I just can't seem to get out of my mouth. But anyway, I think that's probably the video, and um, yeah, that was me putting stuff down that caused the camera to go there. Um, but anyway, that's the video. I hope that you have enjoyed it, and I hope that you have a great day. Bye.